And welcome back, this is Baller Scooper with an episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 2. I am joined as always by my trusty squad of Luke, Nova, and Bro, and Gareth is with us once again. Now, I just exited the Mesidian Tower and... What the hell happened to Altair? Uh, dudes? Dudes? Well, it should be easy if I could take care of this on screen. What the f Okay, apparently, me going through the Mesidian Tower has had some kind of upgrade on all the enemies here. Luckily, these shouldn't be too tough. I mean, we, we've taken these guys on before, haven't we? We have. Down goes the captain, and that was... That was weird. Must have been some kind of glitch in the game or something, because there's supposed to be goblins around here. Um, I, I can't go in the city of Altair. O okay, um, let's just, let's just avoid random battles. I don't want to see that glitch again. Um, isn't, yeah, Katri Katria? Okay, I can't go in there. Um, l let's head into Finn. We, what the hell is that? Okay, let, let's just head into Finn. Um, Princey! Uh, Hilda! Gordy! I need some help. What the hell is going on? Hey, what's up, Leela? And that storm came and the, sho the ship broke off. I thought I lost you all for good, dear Lord of the Seas. She doesn't want back in our party. We could have a party of five. It'd be awesome. The Emperor has created a cyclone and has already destroyed Altair, Gatria, Paloom, and Poft. It is now coming to Finn. What? The Emperor himself must be controlling the cyclone. What? I made you retrieve the Ultimate Scroll, but I'm afraid the cyclo cyclone will solve us all before we can use it. Oh, I already have that memorized. It will be impossible to permeate the wall of wind from the ground. Um, so shouldn't I get, like, an, like, the Dreadnought? No, the airship. Damn you. Okay, so, apparently, while we were in that tower, fighting off everybody because that tower took forever, all this crap happened. Which is awesome. So I am going to heal up and make room in my inventory and uh, probably level up some, some spells and I'll be right back. I have done just a little bit of level grinding and I did get Ultima and Flare up to level 5. I have not done anything on Osmos or for Haste. Haste I did learn... Um, because I picked them up from sorcerers in the fights out outside here. I also sold a ton of the spells that the sorcerers gave me because I fought so many of them, and now I have more gil than I will probably ever need. We are still outside Finn. Let's go back inside to the castle because there's actually something we need to do in here. How you're supposed to know that you need to do this is beyond me. I've never, ever seen anybody in any of the towns or anything like that give a clue as to how you're supposed to know to come here to this mirror that we've never seen before and show it an item and of all items to show it the pendant it is absorbing the light from the pendant oh was that the dragon egg? Hey! Whoa! That's... That's... It's like a little itty bitty dragon. A reflection of a Windrake I can be seen in the mirror. It is the Windrake hatched from the dragon's egg. The Windrake is flying towards Finn! Wait, what? Did we summon it? It's a motherfucking baby dragon! Hell yeah, fly through that cloud! Baby dragon! I mean, how old could it possibly be? 
Nice. And into the room it comes. And it lands slightly to our right. Gareth? What? Oh, that's right, he's a dragoon. The dragoon and the wind drake were brought together at last. And then the wind drake flies off, so what was the point of that? Well, now we have a wind drake in our inventory. The last, last wind drake, and apparently Gareth must be the last dragoon. Even though technically the wind drake is not in our inventory. Um, it still takes up a spot in the inventory. It's very confusing to me. So we are done here in the castle. There is one more thing, though, that we need to do in the town of Finn. We need to go over here to the southwestern corner. Do you remember who lives here? I bet you don't. It's Pavel! What's up, Pavel? Look, I gotta be honest, your next target is a cyclone. I don't know how you get you can get that one. Oh, please, now you're gonna go inside that thing? I tell you, maybe I can help you. I'll give you my treasure. Search, search the wall next to the bed. Awesome, so uh, we finally get his treasure. Is it right here? Here? Nope, must be up here. Holy crap, this, there better be some good stuff here. Ninja suit, ruby plate, thieves gloves, Gold plate, elixir, gold hairpin, silver plate, and another blood sword. Sweet as any of this, an upgrade. Not for Luke, but it is for Nova compared to the black robe. Not even close. But it raises her intelligence, but let's take a look at her intelligence. It is already 99, so what's the point of having something raise it? even further. Gold hairpin is an upgrade. Yeah, I'll keep that. And, um, I think you had the white robe on. Oh, wow, the ruby plate sucks. Maybe I can sell that because it's got rubies on it. Uh, yeah, we'll get the white robe on him, but he needs that ancient sword still on. As you've seen, it is very, very effective against bosses. And that's it for Finn, we are done here. Now that we have a means of getting inside the cyclone, and that means is, of course, our baby dragon. There's got to be some kind of name for a baby dragon. All I can think of is, like, Dragonite, and then that only makes me think Dratini. But that can't be right. That can't be right at all. So let's head for the cyclone, and... Automatically on board, our baby dragon, who is still strong enough to carry all four of us. It did not look like it was big enough, but apparently it is. What the hell is that? Is this where the Emperor is? Damn. The Empire is strong. I wonder if everybody's like, we could never defeat the Empire. Yeah, no shit, look at that. But don't worry, we are sending our best four in. Actually, is Gareth better than Whale? Whatever, we're sending four of our best five in, and now we're in the cyclone on the first floor. Okay. So, sweet. And I already see stairs, that's a good sign. And up here, we have a ripper, which is a dagger that nobody can use. Awesome. Awesome. And we have a new enemy. It's a wood golem. And because it's wood, and for that reason alone, I'm going to try to burn it. Now watch the game tell me that you cannot burn wood. Holy crap. Fire 8. Burn the wood. Thank you. It can burn. What do you know? My real-life logic also works in Final Fantasy. I might heal him. I might. But not right now. First, we need to keep going and follow this little path to the next set of stairs. But first, we must take on the Sucky Bus. Which is awesome. Uh, no. 
We will show off Flair later. Flair and Ultima will make their appearance, don't you worry about it. But it will not be right now. I did get the first strike, the preemptive strike on these guys. And I do remember that they burned. Apparently they don't burn as much as I remember. Luke should be able to finish off the sucky bus, and then that should be the only vampirette to get a turn in. Um, for some reason, when the game gives you more than two rows of enemies, only the front two rows will get an attack. So if there's a row in the middle that is empty when the, the when the turn starts, the people at the back will never get a turn or never get to attack that turn. It's very very weird. I don't like the looks of that. And that's probably why. Because it all hurts, damn it. We get a Venom Axe. Ooh, a new axe. It's been a while since we got a new axe. We're still on the Ogre Killer. Is this Venom Axe? Hell yeah! Look at that. It's up by 18. That's awesome. Let's go back over to the electric floor. So it's back down to the first floor where we started. After doing the electric slide on those little panels there. That was awesome. Because these stairs only lead to treasure. They don't lead to the end of the dungeon. And we do have new enemies here. We have Lamias. Now we did fight the Lamia Queen. Um, I don't remember if they were weak to fire. But I will try it because a lot of people seem to be weak to fire. Damn you, stop picking on Gary. He can't handle this kind of pressure! Yeah, there's the Venomax. It does quite a bit of damage. Get the curse on! That's the important thing! No, no curse. Okay. Come on, Fire. That's not nearly as good as I thought it would be. Actually... Can we cast Holy on these people? That'd be awesome. I mean, they're snakes. That means they're, like, undead, right? It did a bit! It did a bit! Oh, no. This is why I hate Lamias. Yeah, you can cast Blink all you want. And you can cast Arrows all you want. Just don't try to confuse me! Uh, the only good thing about getting confused... I will definitely need... Uh, let's show off Ultima, why not? Um, fire's still going to be our best one, best bet here. Let's see how Ultima does. It is still only level 5, but it should do a bit of damage. No. No, it does not. See, this is why...